Watch this! Right, let's go, uh, Finley. I want to get, like, the Shutterwalk deck going against dragons specifically. That seems fun. So we can just kind of, like, perpetually poof their minions. All right, uh, Mr. Scoutman. All right, folks, the deck is Sir Finley Control Shutterwalk Shaman. The goal of the deck is to punish the Dragon Druids by poofing their board with Anachronos and Reno Lone Ranger and then doing that on repeat with an infinite Shutterwalk combo. If you're watching this on YouTube, don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. You can catch me live at twitch.tv slash raffle or here on YouTube. Looking for a fight? You found one. Stand aside, being. It is time to save the world. This is just one of our better early game cards right now, man. So we hear a power on one to play the flow rider and then play this on three. This gives me something for next turn. Go with the flow. This could allow me to snag one of their um, like soul stealers or something. I wait to Which if nothing else could be fun. Okay, weapon is online. I want to play this next turn, so no hero power. We start hero powering next turn with the uh, chain gang. Just trying to get some corpses online, I would imagine. So they can start healing. Seeing your scout next turn. Um, probably got to hold the hero power again. Because uh, we know they're likely to play a eulogizer here. Heavily page or probably the Forgeborn, right? They need Death Strike here. This is not what we stood for. That is not it. All right, good start. Phase shifting seems bad. Recycling seems tempting. Crystal gem, obviously very good. Kind of like the time that recycling buys us. <laughs> Second shutter walk with a bunch of garbage. I think it's probably just the caverns bucket here. I, do things my own I mean, I guess that one's okay. Stand aside, being. It is time to save the world. Uh, Cariel isn't great for this hero power. Bronze Signet could be good. Really? I don't think so. I think that creates a problem that our deck already has and attempts to solve a problem that the deck doesn't have. Uh, Sticky Finger is tier 1, so we can't get that. I would have liked to. Probably hold the hero power next turn. Try and play this. Yes. Mana storm? I mean, I would take a mana storm for sure. Is someone injured? I might want to play an Okani next turn. 
So I'm gonna hold the hero power. I wanna maintain the coin. I'm seven. Priest. I cannot wait to read these. Predictors well not that in my house. Ah, uh, that's incredible. I always forget it heals friendly minions as well. This is maybe the Unter? See, this is why I don't think that Bronze Signet is great in this deck. We already have, like, hand size issues, right? Is that online? Sure looks like it. Next turn's a off turn, so probably a good hero power turn. That seems like a lot of damage. You have two Coliseums? Yes, I've played one, though. Well, looking for a stand-up? Careful! It's against me! I'm seven years old. Must mean it's something good at the top of my deck. Can't be Shudder at least. I still need a Grumble. What's yours? Oh, okay. Wait, is that good? They just steal it. And that doesn't seem... What are you doing? A lot of armor from that recycling stone. Our hardships only strengthen our resilience. Remember the song. Very nice. 
hardships only strengthen our resilience. They just stole all of my hero cards. Recycling how can of pass up against Tree of Life at least Tree of Life, yeah. That's the sole reason we chose it. Our gift of frost shields us. Let's just go here into bird next turn. At least we have infinite damage. We have infinite damage, infinite board clears. Infinite everything. Nice. Poison. Mine Apocalypse is also pretty tempting. Like to get to the Anachronos and stuff earlier. I think I just need the ramp. This is really good for me against anything that isn't like a burn heavy deck. Burge. Double Burge. So about those burn heavy decks. Okay, well, you can take half damage, but half of infinity is still a lot of damage. next turn. At least have the option to do so. Oh, they're just trying to get hand space going. Uh, maybe just go for the Astolor game plan. down next turn or not the Reno not the Reno could also just play the Astolor but 
think carry all makes sense getting that repetitive damage from our hero for zero mana. Fantastic animations. Glad we got this opponent before they got the Ring of Black Ice, though. Because that would have been extremely annoying. Shadowwalk Lethal. good lethal shot here, right? So, if we do this, we do this. And we just uh, shadow walk next turn. The delay on the freeze tricks me? Yeah, it's a... Uh, it's a little annoying, but what are you going to do? one more minion, but it shouldn't matter because we're dealing 14 next turn. GG. My jaws that my the Astellar game plan does seem to be the way to have gone here. Uh, Hagatha? I don't, like, really want anything spell-based right now. Agatha is pretty nice with things like the uh, Twin Fin. Like, it, it's the thing that does stuff with our deck. It's very good. It's just, like, I guess it pushes us off of the Astellar game plan, and that's fine. Both Kegar and Idols are so good, but not for this deck? Yeah. Yeah, that is... It does feel a bit like a waste. But, yeah, we'll just take the Embrace. And then... I guess we just go here? For a fight, you found one. Stand aside, being. It is time to save the world. I like juicing the uh, twin fin early. I mean, earlier I got eight out of nine um, neutral cards in my offering. That was pretty rough. Jeez, what are these? I don't know. Surely we find some totems later. I 
Can I get those embrace only two? Oh, okay. I need to learn how cards work. I'll cut you where you stand. That's annoying. More shutters. Any battle cry totems other than amalgams? Uh, not that I can think of. Seems like a thing that I might want in the Shutterwalk pool, even if it's maybe a bit of a liability. It's good with the it's good with the Carriel, it's good with the Astalor. Here, so that we can play this guy next turn. Welcome, Robert. The Googleizer again. Also denies their health gain, like off of a uh, Primus. No. Guess I should have hero powered. Just feels wasteful to throw a senior scout out there like the loss will be mourned and you this. this feels quite useful. Is there rainbow? Probably means I need to be aware of a um, Rexa. And those are actually going to get quite annoying at a certain point. Yeah, welcome, Toast. At least until we can get our Reno online. All right. Um. Souls to harvest. I'm sure I'm playing this next turn. So no overload this turn. What will wet your whistle? All's well that sun wells. Cowboy value, yeah. I mean, it's also just uh, more card draw, which is not too bad. Our hardships only strengthen our resilience. Got three shadow locks, four, five. Remember the or I guess four in hand, but quite a lot total. Like, I could just play this for the carryall. I've got birds queued up. Allow me to dump cards alongside it. That is their fourth, but they don't have anything big to resummon, do they? Just a ball buster? The room oh, okay. your fate. Remnant 
Prince of Life. The Citadel stands strong! Oh, you poor thing. Snicker Snack! Try to keep yourselves alive! Remember the Fallen! I don't want to put anything big on the board this turn. Explicit rule right now. They're not bringing back the. Uh... Couldn't they just snag the Primus here? Or are they tunneling in on the. Uh... What do we have here? Getting Ruska back. Forged a um, probably another eulogizer. Any danger with hitting the battle cry limit with the, on the shutter with the hero fire minions? Uh, probably not, just because um, like we override the hero power pretty early on with the uh, carryal and the eventually the Reno as well. That doesn't seem optimal for them. Snicker snack. Should just be able to close things out with the carryall here, unless I don't know something do weird we happens. Your totem should be insane by now. Yeah, yeah, they're out of control. I don't think the opponent likes playing against Shadowwalk decks. It's like it's shadow casting itself. I mean, yeah, that's why like of the decks that could make use of shadow casting, I think that this is one like low on the priority list, right? Just because it. Once it gets online, it already does its thing. God, I love this card so much. But with the uh, with the Hagatha's embrace, it's just got to be Gnomish, right? Crowding our board a little bit. We could just uh, get the saxophone and the flow rider again. Starlight Groove is great for all the uh, holy spells that we don't have. I feel like there are a lot better options for the world. shadow Spend casting. The it is time to save the world. Okay, we could give this guy Wind Fury. Cloak. Let's buff these boys. One mana, 14 damage each round sounds pretty baller. I mean, yeah, but that's starting on turn 11. <laughs> right? Like, I don't think Astalor is the kind of card you want with, uh, I think you want cheaper battle cries. Like, 
like how many Astolers do you actually need to win the game? Not infinite. With every step, the light guides you. Yeah, with a card like Tainted Remnant, the game ends before you would ever even um, have the Astolor online. Please, not objection. Nice. Still better for me than objection. Probably want one of the fives next turn. Estelar would be way too slow for the type of deck that Shadowcasting wants to be in. Yeah, I think a lot of times, and I think it's... Like, it, Shadowcasting, I'm not going to turn down. It would be good in this deck. But I think a lot of people see the word battle cry and go, Oh my god, Shadowcasting would be heckin' broken. Without, like, thinking about what Shadowcasting typically does, right? Or the type of thing that Shadowcasting actually enables, I guess, is more accurate. I'd like to get the uh, Thorison down at some point so that I can reduce the cost of this gnomish. State with the uh... oh, that may be the most amount of value anyone has ever gotten off of a uh, whatever that spell was. Just have to probably hold the cold storage to play around potentially counter spell. Once we want to go in on the uh, the go turn. With every step, the light guides you. It's also a lot of damage. Oh yeah, they should have played the giant first, in fact, if they had the mana to do so, which I don't think it reduced by... The sword in the so they should have. Yoink! so much. <laughs> Mostly because I never play around it. And I'm disconnected. Alright, I need to do a quick quit.
Whenever I quit, I get terrified of conceding by mistake. You don't know how many times I've probably done that. Uh, there's a decent chance I could attack. It's a 50-50, so I'm going to enter first, even though I missed two damage. Very nice. That is the outcome I was going for. Arcane bolt. Our gift of frost us. This is 18 damage. If only we had these reduced, that would be a lot of fun. What did that do? I don't think I'm going to be putting Death Rattle minions into my deck. Uh, this one. The Gavel and the Banana Man are both pretty good, and then we just accept the uh, Alpha. Gonna be rich and save the world. Stand aside. It is time to save I mean, if I keep both of these Burge... I only need to draw the Enter the Coliseum and Reno's online. It's not a good strategy, but let's go for it. Oh, right, I just need the Alpha as well. Muscle Man. Oh, I didn't even look at what they've got all together now. That would have been nice for me. Rob. We just go Muscle Man next turn. Could coin a five if I wanted to. It seems difficult to deal with. Don't even need to coin it. Here you go. Burge. Reno's online. Oh, they're just gonna hero power it down. Curious, what is that? Five cars in the left side of your hand. Uh, none of your business. Looking for a standoff? 
Careful. Who's our biggest boy? Oh, Burge. But that uh, spell damage is actually doing a lot of work. It's the reason people put Asolar in the ETC. Uh, to avoid... Adding extra sets, I would imagine. Hang on! One shot is on my eye! Here comes the drop! That way we don't have to include um Lich King. Hot in you, priceless! Yeah, bucket manipulation. Swing first in case uh, One shot is all we hit. I need. That gives us two shots One on this turn. It's unfortunate. Our gift of fire empowers us. Right. Uh, that does give us Shutterwalk into Burge next turn, though. Similar experience for the opponent, I guess. There are no macaw charge lethal. Uh, doesn't look like it, right? Would have dealt another twenty. Plus, it would have left minions on the board, so we would have dealt even less damage to face. Oh, right, they, they don't necessarily get the Titan one. What do I do with all these cards? Probably no reason to play around or play into Omayog here, right? Never give up. Run away. No, 
thank you to these. Spells be the greatest weapon of all. Stand aside, being. It is time to save the world. Hmm. Might have been worth considering keeping the ETC, but this actually seems pretty good. Mindseer nerf in Wild Win. Uh, I would guess... Never. I mean, it's fine, right? It could be useful. Orb probably does lean more towards some sort of burn game plan, but we'll see. I've got healing. They've got freeze still. Who knows? We do know that they have another one of those, though. Duels is a healthy game mode. I don't think healthy is a clear way to describe a game mode. I think it's a fun game mode. Make sure I'm able to play the senior scout next turn so that I can stop their freeze minions. Wild is bad right now. Uh, no one said that. The only healthy game mode is when I have to do 10 push ups after every even shaman in wild. Uh, that's gonna get to the point where it's no longer healthy and your shoulders might uh, run into some problems. So even then, I'm not sold. I like the idea overall. Thank you, Ono. There's a world where I play double three next turn. So if we're going to hero power, it's probably next turn. None may steal our secrets. We just need the macaws, and our Reno effects are online. I'm probably going to play the spirit before then, but uh, we could also just use that as our minion to hold for the army knife. Discovery. Do I have any holy spells? I have the Starlight Groove. Why not? None may steal our secrets. All's well that sun wells.
pretty good card for next turn. That works nicely with the uh, Agathas. May the light grant you peace. Who am I? None of your business. And I want to just start getting minions that aren't this out of hand so that I can have buffs land on it. And then it get a lot of damage off of the uh, Gnomish. Then good use of that Divine Shield. I think I Hero Power first and then carry all, just so that I can get a little bit of extra value out of it. Change my mind. That gives me a win condition. Our hardships only so I don't need to go hunting for more value or cards. Remember the fallen. Job done. And like the ETC creates hand size issues or complications with hand size at least. Alright, they are going to start freezing my face, which is annoying, but not the end of the world. I've got ways to play around that. We know it's not objection. Kind of looks like it might be rigged fair game, even like vape niche. I don't know. It could be literally anything. Oasis Alley too. True. Pretty far off from the Reno being online. I keep whiffing on what says my target. It is getting to be a lot of damage though. GG. Often. It's 12 plus 18. Let's go here to test for counter. That's why I didn't want to go fully in on this play. There are too many secrets that uh, made my life very difficult. Your the 
completion of my research. The Gnomish doesn't give charge anymore. You're so smart. We missed again. Our gift of fire empowers us. Boy, that's frustrating. Yeah, the Gazakus Gnomish doesn't give charge anymore, but uh, this one very much does. You are unable to comprehend. Let's make magic. Don't think too hard. You'll hurt yourself. We know what the secrets are, right? Oof. Hit your own face. God. Oh, one is random. Should be fine. Actually, oh, they don't want to overdraw. Gaze into the horizon. You will see. Do not be deceived. Do not be deceived. Hmm. I've been deceived. Yeah, let's go mob. These are... pretty horrendous. I guess we just take the cavern's bucket. It gives us some holy spells. So many Renos this run. Gotta be rich <laughs> and to save the world. Stand aside, being. It is time to save the world. Horrendous cards never stopped a Finley run that shouldn't have gone past three wins. I don't think we have horrendous cards though. Our deck's fine. Purge. Uh, Ashen Elementals are likely popular in Wild because everybody hates Quest Mage. Do I have any weapons left? I do not. is required. The all signature is required. Their secret mage with this hero power. Guess that makes sense. We can just mob that. Uh, 
that could get some silly value. So we just start a chain of gnomish army knives, right? And then eventually, if we don't play, if we don't cast any spells, theoretically, we could have those on the shutter. I'm not sure how the uh, minecart cruiser works. I haven't really been in a situation where I've been able to test it yet. Inside of the shutter, that is. Okay, so I probably don't play the cold storage this game, right? Really? It's not too heavy. In the wrong order. Didn't end up mattering. Played on an enemy. I suppose that's true, yeah. in here? Oh, right, the chain gang. I don't want to play that for sure, though. My client has the heart of a peer. I don't want to proc a flame ward there. I'm a senior explorer now. You'll blow my cover. Uh oh, book. Play around counter spell. Which one of these I want? You 
grow my cover. Oh, you're right. I didn't want to do the Doc Holiday. I just tunneled in because it's such a good card. But that could create some problems for me. Your son welcome. Devil Really? It's not too heavy. Any more birds? Your signature is required. Hyper Blaster. No more birds, just find Shadowwell. Yes, Master. It's large. My powers are never truly gone. Just get this out of hand, right? Or not? Really, it's not too heavy. Urge. Initializing the set. There we go. Wait, that's a lot of damage too. Job done. And then we follow at the burge. Depending on the order, we could get two copies. Yeah, we get two copies. <laughs> We played the grumble, I guess. Oh wait, no, the poison killed it. That's hilarious. Behold the tools of creation. Oh, what a silly game that was. Right. More Floridas? Because I think it should do fine into Dragon Druid. Stand aside, being. It is time to save the world. What is that hero power? Is that the one that repeats when it kills something? Okay, so they're still taunt. Say hello to my big Jeez. friend. Fire your cannons twice. Okay. Go with the flow. Say hello to my big friend. Go. This with the Hagatha's embrace is just uh, too good to pass up. Double time! Double time! Yeah! It's a 
Urge. Reno remove the cannon. Uh, if he's active, I don't see why not. He's not going to be active for a bit. Got double groove, double spirit, and triple bird. Yowza. I give myself options for next turn. And my hand is starting to get a little bit cramped. But probably just going with the senior scout. Man, I got this. Got Muscle Man into Twin Fin if I want it. Also, just got an obscene amount of removal over the course of this game. So even if they do make some large fellas, largely okay. Yeah, the battle pickaxe is gone at least. Uh, we could do another gnomish game plan. For a master tactician, this is nothing. None may steal our secrets. Hang on! It's a rocky ride! Here comes the rock! Oh, here, 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 here. Has science gone too far? Oh, it makes a 3-3. It makes a random minion a 3-3. It's not what I would call a good strategy. When I can instead save it for uh, another copy of Anachronos. Said we only need the starlight and the Reno is active. So if we can delay for that long, we should be in a reasonable spot. Spirit Alpha? 
Uh oh, yeah, it's at bottom. Okay, the separation on deck tracker messed me up there. So we have to draw the other one. Uh oh. It's a lot of mana they just spent. GG. Probably just another mob. No, no. We have an surly mob and surly mob in deck. Don't they count as duplicates? Uh, yeah, probably. But Reno is not the main thing your deck is doing anymore, so I'm not worried about that. Hat. Hat is the shuffle, right? No, hat is the hand. Saxophone. Okay, then. Okay. Well then. Mistakes were made. curve with this hand right now. Uh, they might have gotten Hat or Mind Apocalypse, I guess. But either way, the important thing is it gives them a spell, right? Yeah, so they should have a way to get this online. Could also give them the uh, Surly Mob. We do have two of those. Crusty Companion. Yeah, we've got quite a lot of spells at least. Uh, do they want zero mana stuff? Oh yeah, I guess we do have a bomb in our deck. Okay, so this game's over. Getting aggro here. Guess they burned that, right? Maybe I should have kept the merch seller on top to avoid drawing the bombs. I don't think I have a way to win from here. I 
should have just pressed this, yeah. Still didn't have a way to win, but I guess this could have gotten me there. Job's done. All right, well, I, I pack tactics, I guess. Oh. Mysterious Tomes wins game single-handedly, gets no respect as a passive. That's, it gets a lot of respect as a passive. I can't wait to be told in my comments that I should have played or not attacked into a pack tactics there, though. A uh, different second passive this time, right? Say this all the time, but same opponent. Uh, it's almost like it's it's almost never the same opponent. There's just it's so rare. There's honestly no point in asking. is already almost online. I'm just getting obliterated by these secrets right now. And by the idols, I guess. Card out of hand here. And make sure that we're able to play a five next turn. It's not hard to get to ten cards in this matchup, it's just rarely worth. Idols is uh, not a rare treasure. People confuse it with the, the other one that is rare. that doubles up your first spell. Blast charge. Oh my god. For the opponent that has everything. Looks like I'm here just in time. Saxophone. Stop believing. I mean, this game is still winnable. It's just the opponent's pace of play is becoming obnoxious. Like, why?
What do you even turn into a tram man? It's my biggest minion. They're all so small right now. Mistakes of the past. Rewards. Just don't die here. But that's hard to do. Uh, this is probably the least damaging. Double grumble. Are you trying to ruin my espionage? Stand aside, being. It is time to save the world. Uh, the anachronist is probably too slow. Okay, it's mix. Uh, if they go tall, we've got this as a decent answer. Home in the shadows. Problem is, like these trash minions, just uh, the damage kind of stacks up after a while. need to go here and here next turn. I would never. I don't even think I have a way to deal a, source, a single point of damage. is actually relevant in the matchup. Well met. Thanks for the great streams and content. Hey, you're welcome, HD. Thank you for the eight months. Glad you're enjoying the content. Okay. That's mega alarming. Probably freeze it and play the henchman. to get some cost reduction on the uh, the bear. But it's kind of starting to look like we're going to be in a situation where we just need to take a 50-50, which oh, will feel very bad. There's a lot of damage coming at me. I 
that Meek Mastery is doing a little bit better than my uh, Agatha's Embrace. Just terrified of them having like a big magnetic minion to put on that. Just 360 no-scope it here. Worst outcome. Really? It's not too heavy. Some healing, which we're going to need because we just whiffed. I was really trying to find the Anachronos. Wait, is that this is the mech that they up. So that's not the end of the world, at least. Too many cars. Oh, oh, bother. All's well that sun wells. Just not hitting our uh, swing cards fast enough here. Wait, it's not play order? That's actually really quite bad for me that it's not play order. I don't think I have outs anymore. We just played, uh, this will be 12 games of Hearthstone and we, in duels, and we hit zero Dragon Druids. The deck Ruffle we were trying to beat. the most impressive hairline on Twitch. While everyone else retreats, Ruffles steady as a rock. I don't know about that, but, uh, thank you, Weaponized Ketchup. None of these do anything. these do anything. Anachronos? I don't draw a card for turn. How can I get an Anachronos? I have no outs. That's what I meant when I said I have no outs. Well, that was frustrating. It's the second time I built a deck to queue into Dragon Druid and didn't queue into Dragon Druid. Alright, uh, I mean, we got a fair amount of gold at least, so happy to see that.